Uh, just to forewarn you, my set is going to be very still, because I'm rather large and these lights are rather hot. This feels like comedy rotisserie. I feel like I'm doing my jokes on a Boston market. A horse walks into a bar! Bartender asks him why the long face. That was funny. Uh, just to start off myself with a bit of a public service announcement. Stop trying to be so politically correct. In this day and age, a lot of people are worried about being labeled a bigot accidentally. Like, they don't want to have to worry about that. Knowing that fact, I like to have a little bit of fun with that. You guys could try this on your free time, why not? Here's what I do to have a little fun with that fact. I like to find a large group of unassuming white people <laughs> bantering amongst themselves, work my way into the midst of them. I wait till it gets real quiet and then I scream out, what do you mean, you people? And they start apologizing, offering reparations, it's great. I did that on the train the other day. This one white guy decided to speak for the whole car. Listen, man, I don't know who said that, but I would like to offer you my iPod. I'm sorry. <laughs> we square, bro. We square. I fist pounded and went along my way. Pounded, dude. Perfect. Perfect example of how nervous we are about race. Whenever Black History Month rolls around, if you notice, certain restaurants change their specials to what they think will be more ethnically appealing dishes. And I'm sure the restaurants have the best interest at heart, but some of them don't turn out too well. Like you walk in and you see the special posted on the door and it'll read out, in honor of Black History Month, this week our special will be chicken and waffles. Like really, is that really, is that where you wanna go with this? Is that? Next week's special will be watermelon and basketballs. Basketballs aren't edible. I'm done with you. I'm done with you. I'm done with this. I am done with this establishment. Like, I just want to know, who's the black coworker that's signing off on all these suggestions? Who's giving management the okay that this is what you should do? Hey boss, come here for a second. Come here for a second. Come here. You wanna know how to bring in more black people? You should put chicken and waffles on the menu. <laughs> no, it's not offensive. Who's the black employee here, me or you? We gonna be rolling in the dollars.